the guys that was to protect and show you a more hidden feature that I was loving better than they found today. First one, iPad trending in music, move to the right when you search on music. So like when you go to search, the trending has moved over to the right a little bit. You spin the middle, but now it's over to the right. Really interesting little changes. Next one is new text for the auto brightness. So like when you go to settings, general, accessibility, display combinations, it will now say turning off auto brightness and my effect power life. Red eye was 10 where it had no text underneath it at all. There's a difference 10 to 11. New text for auto brightness. Next one. The developer logging has been added back to the game center tab. It's like when you go back to game center, logging is back for game center. Just like that. Really cool. In the previous beta, this was removed, but now they added it back. Really cool. Next one is setting the date and time. Automatically text has changed. If you have location surface turned off, then you'll see this change right away. We get a date and time on the iPad, it will say, for some devices, it will say setting time automatically requires locate, turning on location services. But now it was 10 here. On this one, it says automatic time, automatic time zone is accurately improved when location surface is turned on. If you see a difference, they made it a little simpler. Really cool. Next one is add account for reminders that are removed. So like, in iOS, in the Reminders app, we go to this tab to see the ad account has been removed from here. In iOS 10, it they had tab for ad account that's been removed in this beta. Really interesting because they keep removing a few features. The events found in apps have been removed from calendar. So when you go to calendar here, the events found in apps is gone completely. Like the setting events found in apps that's been removed in the latest beta. Interesting changes. The last one is new collapse red on red messages and mail button. So when we go to mail, there's a new option for collapse red messages. Let me go find it on my iPhone 5 here. See here's my iPhone 5. They have an extra option for for collapse red messages right here. I, on iOS 10, they only had three. Now on iOS 11, they have four. Really interesting. So those are the I, those are the last seven hidden features now. So eleven better seven that I can find. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Thanks.